And we are live. Falsha Galer to Falsha Riv Cock. You're all very welcome to the, geez, what month are we now? March edition of the Seamus Ennis Art Centre Zoom sessions. Um, almost a full year at this Zoom crack now. Maybe not with Seamus Ennis specifically, but uh, I believe the first Zoom session was in around this weekend, the uh, in shown weekend that would go on uh, typically. So um, it's, been, <laughs> it's been quite a journey since then, but very happy to communicate with the broad community of people we have uh, through these sessions. It's been really great. Um, so you'll probably notice anybody here in the Zoom chat that you are all muted and uh, that's basically how this is going to work. We're going to do this in a one singer, one song format so as to try and mitigate any latency issues or anything like that. Um, how we'll be selecting singers is we'll just be moving around the room and doing our best to get a good cross section of everybody there. Plenty of young people, plenty of old people, big people, small people, uh, men, women, everything else. Uh, we'll do our best to to see as many people as possible, um, but we probably won't get to everybody, and that's just uh, the way it is. Um, if you were here last month and didn't get a chance to sing, if you could hit the raise hand button, uh, you'll find that down in the reactions tab uh, down at the bottom of the screen. Um, and I will do my best to approach everybody uh, via private message in the chat to tell them uh, that they're up next to sing. If you don't happen to see this, please don't be alarmed. Uh, it's just the way these things work, unfortunately. Um, a special guest for the evening is Ono Kano. Ono's on the screen there. You can give him a wave, a virtual wave, virtual welcome to the Seamus Ennis Arts Centre. We're very excited to see what Ono has for us later on. And uh, yeah, while the chat goes on, please, um, if you can, make use of this chat bar down the side that goes for people in the Zoom meeting and for people on Facebook and YouTube. Tell us what you think of the singers, maybe discuss the uh, origins of songs, uh, maybe, maybe ask the names of songs if you don't know them, and uh, it'll just make for a, a great communal atmosphere as we go along. Um, I have queued up three singers to kick us off. They will be Genevieve Galerno, uh, followed then by Joe O'Connor or Joseph O'Kruhur, and then Bernie Dermody will sing the third song. So I will go over first to the West Coast of America, just uh, outside Olympia, Washington, to Genevieve Galerno. Genevieve, I'm gonna ask to unmute you. And we have you. How are you, Genevieve? I'm doing well. How are you, Dara? Are you going to be sketching and painting throughout the session? I am, yes. Wonderful, wonderful. Always great to see. And what are you going to sing for us? I'm going to sing uh, Green Fields of America. Beautiful, beautiful. In your own time. Farewell to the groves of shillelagh and shamrock farewell to the girls of old ireland all around may their hearts be merry as ever they'd wish for when far away on the ocean i'm bound my mother, father is old, and my mother's right feeble. To leave their home country, it would grieve their hearts sore. Oh, the tears in great drops, down their cheeks they are rolling. To think that I must die upon some far and foreign shore. But what matter to me where my bones they lie buried? If in peace and contentment I can live my life. Oh, the green fields of America. They daily are calling. It's there I'll put an end to my misery and strife. So pack up your sea stars and consider it no longer. Ten dollars a week isn't very bad pay. With no taxes or tithes there to devour up your wages when you're on the green fields of America. Farewell to the dances 
in homes now deserted where tips struck the lightning in splanks from the floor the paving and creaking of hobnails on flagstone and the tears of the old folks in cries of encore for the landlords and bailiffs in vile combination have forced us from hearthstone and homestead away may the crowbar brigade all be doomed to damnation when we're on the green fields of america the timber grows thick on the banks of Columbia with Douglas in grandeur 200 feet tall the salmon and sturgeon dam streamlet and rivers and the high rocky mountains look down on it all o'er the prairie and plain sure the wheat waves all golden the maple gives sugar to sweeten your taste you won't want for corn way out in saskatchewan when you're on the green fields of America. And if you grow weary of pleasure and plenty, of fruit from the orchards and fish from the foam, there is health and good hunting way back in the forest with herds of great moose and the buffalo roam and now to conclude and to finish my ditty if ever friendless irishman passes my way with the best in the house I will treat him and welcome him at home on the green fields of America. Shine. Beautiful stuff, Genevieve. Uh, a song from the Atlantic Northwest, from the Pacific Northwest. Great stuff. Uh, my, my only request is if you're going to draw through the, through the session, give us like some regular updates on your progress. Just stick it up to the camera so we can have a look. Great stuff. Thanks so much. Okay, uh, Thomas Kundal, she is go kunde on chlor. Uh, get a song from Joe O'Connor in County Clare. Joe, I'm going to ask to unmute you. Joe, how are you? Not at all, In um, July of 1819, a young girl from outside the town of Croom in County Limerick was murdered out in the Shannon Estuary by her husband, John Scanlon and his servant man, Stephen Sullivan. Some weeks later, her, her body was washed ashore at Money Point, and she's buried in Boran Cemetery, which is between Kildysert and Kilrush in West Clare. Uh, Scanlon and Sullivan were later hanged for the murder of 15-year-old Ellen Hanley, better known as the Colleen Bourne. There is a lonesome secret place where gentle breezes blow. High, high upon the rolling waves, a maiden whispers low. A ghostly boatman can be seen way out across the bay. And the small birds cry where Ellie died before the break of day. Arise, arise, my own true love, and be my loving wife. You will be my darling to cherish all my life. 
I will be contented if you will be my bride and we'll hear the wild winds whispering along the Shannon side. He has spoke false words, John Scanlon. He has spoke false words to me. You did not keep me safe or warm or love me tenderly. You brought me to this barren place where wild flowers will not grow to make for me a lonesome grave where Shannon waters flow. I came to you, John Scanlon, all in my virgin gown. I loved you at the dawn of day and when the sun went down. I left the house where I was born, outside the town of Croom. Remember how we loved then, John, beneath a young May moon. But now, here in this boat I lie, tossed on a raging tide. I see cold murder on your brow and hate shine from your eyes. Why don't you kiss my cold, cold lips and hold my trembling hand and tell the boatman Sullivan to put me safe on land? I have never sailed a boat way out beyond the blue. I have never plucked a rose caressed by morning dew. No more I'll feel the pangs of love or taste the bitter wine. I'll die on Carrig Island before the morning time. I didn't crave your father's land or brooches of fine gold. The mansion that your parents own seemed dreary, dark and cold. My only wish was to live my life and to be your loving bride and hear the wild winds whispering along the Shannon side. Pray tell to me, John Scanlon, before you take my life, why did you lie upon my bed and take me for your wife? Where are the golden vows you made to love me more and more as we watch the starlight's magic glow along the Shannon shore? I'll curse your name, John Scanlon, on this island where I'll die. You'll reap a lonely death upon the scaffold high. They'd speak your name with hate and shame, where they tell of the Colleen Vaughan. My ghost will ride on the Shannon tide before the break of dawn. There is a lonesome secret place where gentle breezes blow. High, high upon the rolling waves, a maiden whispers low. A ghostly boatman can be seen before the break of day. And a voice cries out, remember me across the stormy bay. Sinead. Stirring stuff, Joe. Thank you very much for that. Uh, very much a, a piece of the past, but has a sad relevance today. Uh, great, great stuff. Okay, uh, we're going to move over now to Bernie Dermody. Bernie, I'm going to ask to unmute you. We have you. Bernie, how are you? Okay, great, Sarah. Yeah. Bernie, just, Bernie was yeah, joking. Sorry, just... huh? Bernie was joking before we came on, came on air that, uh, that, that England won the rugby match, which, of course, uh, is thankfully not the case. Uh, <laughs> But, uh, but, but I'll, I'll admit, I, I, was, I was very pleased to contradict her. <laughs> what are you going to sing I for us, Bernie? Might, I thought you might be worried for a second. <laughs> <clears throat> um, I'll sing a song by um, Sean McCarthy. It's John O'Hara. Gorgeous. <clears throat> I'm a frog in my throat. My name is John O'Hara. I am 81 years old. I left my boyhood days behind to search for fame and gold. I left my home in Trolley Town. In my twenty second year, I would dig the gold on England's shore 
and I make my fortune here. Other weary months in search of gold. Sorry, other weary months in search of work. I tramped through street and road. I shake me down in Camden Town. It was my first abode. No friendly glance to cheer my heart. No man to shake my hand. No easy gold, only rain and cold. In this God forsaken land, go down the trench, proud Irish man, for you are strong and big. Take the shot by the neck. Spit on your hands and dig. Tear out the gold from Mother Earth. From the dawn to fading light. In the nearest pub, you'll spend your sob. And you'll hate and love and fight. I loved a girl in Liverpool, a sweet one from Mayo. I've known some girls from Tiger Bay. And their teeth like virgin snow. I ate my food in small she beans. I drunk the porter black, a dirty bed. Where I lay my head And the lies crawled up my back My bones are getting weary now And my shoulders, they are bent My once black hair is grey with care, and my money is all spent. Soon Sergeant Dare will call me home, and he'll take me by the hand, far from Trolley Town. Lay my body down in this God-forsaken land. Chine. Lovely stuff, Bernie. Thanks so much. Uh, okay, we'll move on to Thanks, Johnny Johnston now. Johnny, uh, I'm going to ask to unmute you. We have Johnny. How are you, Johnny? How's it going, Dara? Good to see you. You too, you too. That's a fine red shirt you're sporting there. Are you up for Wales oh, against France, are you? <laughs> oh, yeah. This is my, this is my Saturday attire. <laughs> <laughs> so thing, things are very different in lockdown, aren't they? Uh, what, what, what you can you wear think? what you like, Dara. You can wear what you like. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you can, you, you, your, your, your washing schedule can be a bit more liberal than usual as well. <laughs> but I've said too much. <laughs> what do you have for us, Johnny? 
Good man. Um, tomorrow's international um, day against discrimination, racial discrimination. So uh, it's a song about Anna Frank. So I'd like to sing it. And what did you dream, my love, my love, that woke you from your sleep? I dreamed I saw the soldier again march up our street. And I saw them in their uniforms and their boots of shining leather. And I knew when they came to my front door that they would go no farther. And the wind, it blows from the Zyder Zee. And Amsterdam is weeping. But Vincent's tears can wash away the shame that we are feeling. And what did you dream, my love, my love, that keeps you now from sleeping? And I heard the soldiers on the stairs, and foreign tongues were speaking, and they took me to the railway yard where the carriages awaited for on their sleeve was a crooked cross and mine was a star of David and the wind blows cold from the Zyder Zee and Amsterdam is weeping but Vincent's tears can wash away the shame that we are feeling Oh, what did you dream my long, my long, that are tears upon your pillow. And I saw the chimneys in the east and the black stoke from them below. And I slowly swept across the land till it covered every nation but no one heard my lonesome cry or came to my salvation and the wind it blows from the Zyder Zee and Amsterdam is weeping but Vincent's tears and wash away the shame that we are feeling. So sleep, my love, it is over now. And it is time that you were leaving. For the morning stars are fading fast. There is no more time. Dreaming, but the sun will warm the earth again and dry up all the sorrow, the flowers that faded yesterday will bloom again tomorrow. And the wind, it blows from the Zyder Zee. And Amsterdam is weeping. But Vincent's tears 
and wash away the shame that we are feeling. Thanks for the invite, Tara. Mighty, mighty stuff, Johnny. Jesus, there's no, no messing around this evening. I think we've hit every point in the emotional spectrum in the first four songs, but beautiful, beautiful singing nonetheless. Thank you very much, Johnny. Um, okay, we are going to uh, head on now over to Connor O'Kane. Now, Connor has made a, a very cunning suggestion, which is that he would do a duet with uh, another member of the congregation, uh, if I can call them that. Um, we did have some feedback issues in our sound check earlier, but if we give it a try and it works, there should be no reason why that won't work. So Connor, let me see. I've asked to unmute you, Connor. Oh no, no, wrong Connor. I meant, meant Connor okay. Um We have you, Connor, how are you? I'm not too bad, I'm not too bad. And, I've and, and, to the show. All the way uh, back to Derry, to get to Dublin. It's amazing what you can do these days, isn't it? You can cover some ground just from uh, from sitting on your hole. Uh, uh, who are you going to be singing with this evening? Well, if she's still in the room, uh, myself and Lainey, we're going to give one a shot. Right, so I'm going to attempt to unmute Lainey and see if this works. Lainey, I tell you what, will, you, will the pair of you just give us a one-two and just make sure we're not getting any feedback on the two lines? It was, we're having an issue with it earlier on. Sure. One. Two. I think we're okay. What are you going to sing for us? The very well. Yeah. When very time comes run each year, there's population swelling. There's every kind of picker there and every kind of dwelling. There's tents and huts and caravans. There's bothies and there's bivvies. I am shelters made with tatty bags and dugouts made with divvies. There's corner boys from Glasgow, kettle boilers from Lockheed. There's miners from the pits of Fife, mill workers from Dundee. There's fisher folk from Peterhead and tramps from everywhere. All looking for a loving of the berry fields of Blair. There's travellers fae the Western Niles, fae Aaron Mullen Sky, fae Harris, Lewis and Kyle's a beaut, they come their luck to try. Fae Inverness and Aberdeen, fae Stornoway and Wick, all flock to blare at the very time the straws and rasps they pick. There's some that earns a pound or two, some canny earn their keep. There's some work right from morn to night, and some would rather sleep. There's some that has to pick or starve, and some that doesn't care. There's some that bless, and some that curse, the berry fields of Blair. Now there's families picking for one person, some were pick a lane. And there's men were share and share alike, we waves it's no the rain. There's gladness, I am sadness too, there's happy hearts and sail. For there's comedy and tragedy played on the fields of Blair. But before me pen I do put down, it's to say half they say. You will travel far before you meet we kinder folk than thee. For I've mixed with them and field and pub and wine, I breath the spare. I bless the hand that led me to the very fields of Blair. <laughs> mighty, mighty stuff. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad that worked. Now that we didn't have any uh, any issues with, with with feedback, whatever. Now you were you were just remarking before you sang there, Connor. Uh, amazing the things you can do on Zoom. Uh, after that performance, I I can only agree with you. Wonderful, wonderful stuff. Two great singers for the price of one. Okay, um, I had planned to move on to Bill Dunlap next one, but he actually just sent a message there saying he had to uh, head out for a second. So we'll get him shortly. Um, what I might do instead then is just jump to another one of our guests who wasn't heard last month. Um, I think Marnie Cronin, we have you there. Mara, sorry to uh, catch you on the hop there, but if you'd sing us a song, 
You will be much obliged. How are you, Mara? I'm not too bad at all. I'm enjoying, there's an awful lot going on this, this weekend and I'm it's, enjoying every bit of it. <laughs> it's, it's, it's a bit, it's a bit much, but, uh, but if, if, if I know, get, it's not if a, you get a day planner, you can get through it all. <laughs> So I am going to chance uh, a song that I robbed off of um, Luke Cheevers. Um, and I haven't sung it in ages. So I'm going to try it. And if not, I'll just kind of double back on one of the, you know, you know, the, the kind of I can sing it anytime, any place, anywhere. So I'll, I'll, I'll try this. And if that doesn't work, we'll swiftly go to plan B. Go for it. Mm. Of all the names of all the nations of this earth, I solemnly profess this matchless island of my birth. I surely love the best. No land at all, no land. Or small beneath sun's golden beams, like to the shore that I adore, Calderon's flowery plains, the fruitful fields. Such harvest yield Sure nowhere can be found Where flowers grow Like fallen snow Through all the valleys round Where I rove Through wood or grove You'll hear the feathered train their chirping lays proclaim the praise of Aaron's flowery plains. The huntsman's horn does cheer the morn, his cry is tally-ho. Both rich and poor, you may be sure, tis to the sport they'll go. The fox to chase from place to place, till Ranyard's life is tame. Then home repair, bereft of care, an errand's flowery plains. The angler true, you'll find him too, beside the silvery brook. With his rod and line, he is inclined, the nimble trout to hook. And with his bait, he lies in wait beside the silvery stream till fortune smile repays his tile on Aaron's flowery plains. The Irish mind it is inclined to hospitality their kindness goes of times to grow to prodigality the stranger he will find it free if he his bounty claim He'll find a friend, you may depend, on Aaron's flowery plains. May heaven guard and still reward that sweet high 
Junior's shore. May blessings grace that beauteous place till time it is no more. And shield this prayer with a heart sincere while blood runs through his veins in Paddy's land, that matchless land called Aaron's flowery plains. No fear. I reckon you managed that one fairly handy now, Myra. You put manners on that one, I'd say. Great stuff. Okay, uh, we will head over now to the East Coast United States to Nora Rhodes. Nora has to head off early, so I said I'd try to get her in the first half. Nora, I've asked to unmute you. Hello. We have a, you have a busy weekend, have you? No. Oh, uh, hold up. Uh, okay. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Don't hurt break. yourself. Um, uh, yes. Um, uh, yeah, but, sorry, um, thank you for calling me. Um, um, yeah, it's been quite a busy weekend, uh, and university decisions are being released here, so it's been, um, quite a lot, but, uh, yeah, I'm very happy to be here. Um, and I brought, um, Anarchy Gordon today, which I learned from a recording of Mary Black. Great stuff. Our king is bonny, and there lies my love. My heart lies on him, and will not remove. It will not remove, oh, for all that I have done. Oh, I never will forget. My love, Anarchy. For Anarchy Gordon, he's bonny and he's rough. He'd entice any woman that ever he saw. He'd entice any woman, and so he has done me. Oh, I never will forget me love anarchy. Down came her father, and he's standing by the door, saying, Jeannie, you're trying the tricks of a whore. You care nothing for a man, who cares so much for thee? You must marry Lord Sultan and leave Anarchy. For Anarchy Gordon is barely but a man, for although he may be pretty, but where are his lands? The Sultan's lands are broad, and his towers they are high. You must marry Lord Sultan and leave Anarchy. With Anarchy Gordon, I beg for my bread. And before I marry Sultan, with gold to my head, with gold to my head, and gowns fringed to the knee, I'll die if I can't have me love anarchy. And you that are my parents, to church you may me bring, but unto Lord Sultan I'll never bear a son. To a son or a daughter I'll never bow my knee, and I'll die if I can't have me love anarchy. Jeannie was married 
laid, and from church she was brought home. And when she and her maidens so merry should have been, when she and her maidens so merry should have been, she went unto her chambers and cried all alone. Come to bed now, Jeanie, me honey and my sweet, for to style you my mistress twould be so sweet. Be it mistress or Jeanie, it's all the same to me, but in your bed, Lord Salton, I never will lie. On down came her father, and has spoken with renown, saying you that are her maidens, go loose and have her gone. But she fell down to the floor, so low down by his knee, saying, Father, look, I'm dying, for me love and a the day Jeanie married was the day that Jeanie died, and the day young Anarchy came home on the tides. And down came her maidens, all wringing off their hands, saying, Oh, it's been Alas, you've been so long on the sands, so long on the sands, so long on the flood. They have married your genie, and now she lies dead. You that are her maidens, Go take me by the hand, and take me to the chamber, my love she lies in. And he's kissed her cold lips, till his heart has turned to stone, and he's died in the chamber. His love she lies in. Thank you. Oh, wonderful stuff, Nora. And thanks so much for uh, checking in on such a busy weekend for you. And best of luck with everything, okay? Thank you. No worries. Okay, uh, we will move over now to Sean Faulkner. Sean, I'm going to ask to unmute you. Do we have? We have Sean. How are you, Sean? Fine, thanks. Fine, Pitch pipe at the ready, I see. At the ready, yeah. <laughs> when you get on to my ears, you have to use all the aids you can. <laughs> what have you got for us? Um, I have a song from, uh, it's generally from the from the northeast. It's it's about one of the most uh, famous mortal trials in in Ireland back in about eighteen twenty three. Come, all you tender parents, and listen here on to my sad tale. With a heavy heart and a troubled mind, I will relate to you the same. My dying declaration, I hope it will a warning be to the rising generation for to keep them from the gallows tree. My name it is Bernard McCann and the truth of it I will not deny. In Newton Hamilton I was born and raised by parents tenderly to give me good education, the greatest care and trust they took. 
but unto my condemnation. The path of virtue I forsook. In Castleblaney I was bound, an apprentice to the baking trade. To Patrick Quigley were my days, they were spent in very honest ways. I then went on on to Dromore, that lies within the county down where employment there I did seek, as a journeyman with Adam Sloan. But the maze race is coming on, to recreation I was inclined, and with the giddy multitudes I ran, no hurt nor harm was in my mind. On the 20th day of July, my money had been all gone, and intoxicated all from the races, tis then I made my journey home. Where I waylaid old McAdam for to murder him, I did intend, and to rob him of his money, which has brought me to this shameful end. After this dreadful deed, his body into the canal I threw. Then to the town of Galway, my course I straightway did pursue. Where I changed my name to one John Hughes, hoping justice to escape thereby. But the ever-seeing providence, he would not let that murder die. But in Galway I got married and I spent ten years all in that town. I had twenty-four acres of free land and savings of fifteen hundred pounds. In the height of all me splendor, I neither had peace or content, till I was apprehended, and to down Patrick I was sent. At twenty-nine years of age, I now have to resign my life and leave behind me to be well, five children and a loving wife. May the Lord have mercy upon me, a poor and a wretched man. And whoever reads these verses take, this warning from Bernard McCann. Shinoel. My stuff, Sean. Thanks a million. Uh, okay, Hart uh, got Halliburton and Nish. We're going to go over to Scotland now. Conciana Oil O Lynn Phipps Lynn. I'm going to ask to unmute you. We have you, Lynn. How are you? Good. Morning. Over Sokma, Tapalev. Well, me um and um in a show and um new I guess by Margarita. I hear to the Romeo and I guess and and yeah, he said him. Carson and Roshan um. Ni len ni len ni len kamar tasan na bipor fishin. So um, I, um, I would like to sing um um the mermaid song. I put the words in the chat, so I won't have to explain it anymore. Um, <clears throat> but a song about a mermaid. Great stuff. <clears throat> Whoever is not hard and 
Gorgeous stuff, Lynn. Thank you so much. Uh, okay, we will head back now to Dublin and get a song from Connor Lennon. Connor, uh, oh, you're unmuted already. How are you, Connor? Thanks, Dar. Can you hear me? I can hear you loud and clear. Thanks, Dar. Um, and thanks for asking me to follow that. <laughs> Someone has to do it, Connor. <laughs> um, Lynn, as always, absolutely. I drifted off somewhere else there. That was magic, absolutely magic. Um, okay, um, I sang a song last week at a session, a, a Barty Gleason song, and I've been on a bit of a, a Barty Gleason buzz. Um, I kind of miss him. Um, I used to know Barty from the days of the goalie and down in Tom Mays, and he was always... Uh, he was always great support and he was a good man. I haven't seen him around. So I'm going to try this one. Uh, it's, a, it's, it's on my limits, um, but I'm going to give it a lash. <clears throat> there's a path across the ocean. There's a track across the sea. There are green sunny lands. In some foreign country, I will leave my native Irish land and sail across the sea. And when weary, I'll return to my own country. Why did I leave my native home? Why did I cross the deep? Why did I leave the lands where my forefathers sleep? As I sigh for air and shore and I gaze across the sea, Will I ever get a glance, lovely Aaron of thee? 
I hear no Sabbath bell to awake the Sunday morn. And I hear no reaper singing among the yellow corn. But I hear the tyrant's voice and the wave of slavery. Yet I hear the lanet singing in my own country. Why did I leave my native home? Why did I cross the deep? Why did I leave the land where my forefathers sleep? As I sigh for air and shore and I gaze across the sea, will I ever get a glance? Lovely Aaron of There's a sigh for every woe, there's a balm for every pain. Yet my heart is nearly broken sore till I return again to my own dear native Ireland where I was bred and born, where I'd hear the Leonard singing among the yellow corn. Why did I leave my native home? Why did I cross the deep? Why did I leave the land where my forefathers sleep? As I sigh for air and shore, and I gaze across the sea, will I ever get a glance, lovely air and love thee? Thanks very much, Connor, and uh, let me echo your sentiments of missing. Barry Gleeson. Uh, I don't. I don't imagine Barry is much of a uh, much of a Zoomster nor much of a Facebooker. But uh, on the off chance, Barry, that you're watching out there, we miss you, and we'd love to hear from you soon. Uh, okay, we're going to move over now to Doug Huggins. Uh, Doug, I'm going to ask to unmute you. All the way from Colorado. How are you, Doug? Wonderful. Thank you. We're having wonderful weather here for a change, and snow to follow, of course. Great stuff. I thought I would do the flower of Finet today. Brighter red is the sun on the waves of Loch Sheelan. A cool, gentle breeze from the mountains is stealing. And fair around the islets the small ripples play. But fairer than all is the flower of Finne. Her hair is like night and her eyes like grey morning. She trips on the heather as if it's touch scorning. But her heart and her lips are as mild as May Day. She's Eileen McMahon, the flower of Finne. But who down the hillside like the wild deer runs fleeter? And who on the lakeside is hastening to greet her? 
Hobart Fargus of Harrell, that fiery young blade. The darling and pride of the flower of Finne. One kiss and one clasp and one wild look of gladness. Hello, please leave a message after the talk. Arr. <laughs> one kiss and one clasp and one wild look of gladness. <clears throat> but why does it change of a sudden to sadness? He has told his sad fortune he can no longer stay. He must leave his poor Eile alone in Finne. Now Fergus of Harrell was true to his sire land. Till the dark hand of tyranny drove him from Ireland. He has joined the brigade in the wars far away. And left his poor Eilie, the flower of Finne. He fought at Cremona, she hears of his story. He fought at Cassano, she's proud of his glory. Yet sadly she sings, Shularun all the day. Oh, come back, my darling, come home to Finne. Eight long years have passed, and she's nigh broken-hearted. Her reel and her rock and her flag she has parted. And she sails with the wild geese to Flanders away and leaves her sad parents to mourn in Finne. Lord Clare on the field of Ramillies is charging before him the Sassanac squadrons enlarging. Behind him the cravats their sections display. Beside him rides Fergus and shouts for Finne. On the slopes of La Joudoine, the Frenchmen are flying. Lord Clare and his squadron, the foe still defying. Outnumbered and wounded, retreat in array. And bleeding rights Fergus and thinks on Finne. In the cloisters of Ypres a banner is swaying, and by it a pale weeping maiden is praying. That flags the sole trophy of Ramilly's fray. This nun is poor Eileen, the flower of Finne.
Wonderful, wonderful stuff, wonderful singing, wonderful, wonderful professionalism. You don't get that in the pub. Uh, I was half expecting you to let the, let the message run on and just uh, sing over it with a straight face. It was great singing, Doug. Thank you very much. Uh, okay, uh, we're just going to have two more singers before we head over to our guest for the evening. Uh, first up, we're going to have Maraid Kenny. Maraid, I'm going to ask you to unmute you. And then after that, we'll have Pippin Noble. How are you, Maraid? I'm not too bad, thank you. It's great to have an opportunity to sing. I'm bad. going to sing Alleluia Gauna. Um, it's a farmer praising his wonderful cows. Blessed be my cows. Great stuff. Just straighten myself up. In in there me hene kanahares, the viache mahani kashtev na launa. Viba hani nagam hene gan is when your gini gyanja. Svad the viache vanya chea gam shedlein churna gauna. Allu na gauna na gauna bona. Alluna gauna na gauna be at the far long. Alluna gauna na gauna kiala bona. Na gauna marchin how we ate thou sir na bonta. Fijer dum sakana is fijer dum bura. Is fijer dum sakhina karamu quichuther. Kyol to shina kin ya vetcha hear her in what luvasa Ah Bafin ya lumsa game nak namo e chat kambuya Alleluna gauna na gauna bona Alleluna gauna na gauna be the farlom Alleluna gauna na gauna kyala bona Nakana kiana bona eta sir na bonta. Riser her name of his piano to gown on. His carer the rare he the machins in Atlanta. He sees she had done free a hack as far on watching Yalta. Is Yaki she the while you can and bany go and taru. Halleluja, gauna, na gauna, bona. Halleluja, gauna, na gauna, piati farlom. Halleluja, gauna, na gauna, kiala bona. Na gauna, kajo tauri, ekta sir na bonta. Shine. Lovely stuff, Marae. Thank you so much. Uh, okay, one more song before we head over to our guest, uh, and that will be from Pippa Noble. Pippa, I'm going to unmute you. How are we, Pippa? We're very well, thank you. We've got a bit of spring here. We've got flowers poking their heads above the, um, the dead leaves, so it's all great. <laughs> great stuff. What do you have for us? Well, I've got a song um, that I, I, I learnt this from... Um, Denny Bartley. Um, I've heard other people sing it, but this, his is the version that, that, um, that I, I like best. It's uh, the Bantry Girl's Lament. Pippa, can I, can I just ask before you start, do you have a phone by your speaker or by your computer there? Oh, I'm, just going to, I'm just going to do a dog and throw it away. <laughs> <laughs> is that Great. any better? Yes, it is. Yeah. Less uh, yeah. Uh, as, that might even be better still. So. Yeah. Yeah. No, no, that, that, that's fine. In your own time. Okay, right, okay, right. Mm. Oh, who will plough the fields now? And who will sow the corn? Who will mind the sheep now? And keep them neatly shorn? And the stack that's in the haggard and thrashed it will remain since Johnny went to threshing all in the wars of Spain. And all the cows in the barn yog in sorrow may retire and the piper and his bellows go home and blow his fire. 
Oh, Johnny, lovely Johnny, is sailing o'er the main, away with other patriots to fight the King of Spain. Oh, the boys will surely miss him when the money more comes round. And they grieve that their bold captain is nowhere to be found. And the peelers must stand idle against their will and grain. Since the gallant lad who gave them work now peels the king of Spain. At wakes and hurling matches your likes will seldom see Till you come home again to us, Marsh Doreen McCree And won't you trounce the bookings who show us great disdain Because our eyes are not as bright as those you see in Spain. <coughs> if cruel fate does not permit our Johnny to return, his heavy loss we bantry girls will never cease to mourn. We we'll resign ourselves to our sad lot and die in grief and pain since johnny died for freedom's sake in the foreign land of spain thank you wonderful stuff pippa thank you so much okay well without further ado it gives me great pleasure to announce our guest singer for the evening uh ono kyanawan is a a powerhouse uh, of a singer, of a musician, of a, uh, what do you call it, a polyglot. Um, he's, uh, he's just an all-round all uh, great guy and great singer. Um, originally raised in Dublin, but uh, of a sort of singing tradition uh, that has links in Connemara and um, classical music uh, on the mother side as well. Um, I think you're really going to enjoy him. So could you please put uh, some virtual hands together for Mr. <laughs> Owen O'Kanawine. Uh, Great, Mahabi. Uh, thanks very much. Um... Good to see some uh, faces uh, that I know for, that I haven't seen in a while, and uh, even though they're not too far away from from us either. But um, um, yeah, I suppose uh, I, I thought I'd start with the uh, Liam Weldon song. Um, it's, uh, I think it's uh, we're celebrating twenty five years anniversary there recently, so um, been singing a few of his songs, and um, this one uh, via Ecstasia. Um, so I'll give that a go first, I suppose. Um, I have a concertina below camera level here I was uh, from you know it might make use of it later on um, uh, if you were the restless sea and I the steadfast storm you the wave Kelp above, I the bleaching bones, your little ways to lap my feet, advance and kiss and crouch retreat, surround. Submerged at last complete. Oh, you are not truly one. And are you then a yellow? Sing in the grass 
I a hunting honeybee, pausing ere I pass your little ways to lap my feet. Oh, sugar. And as I sip your nectar sweet, your pollen grain surround my feet. In that ecstatic moment meet, oh, you and I true. And over I then a single seed of all the millions in the field, and you a gentle raindrop from the sky as you fall upon my breast to awaken me from my long rest at that moment by the old God blessed oh you And were you then the last wild leaf on the autumn bough? I, the wind, a wanton thief, to blow as I blow now. And as you'd fall, as fall you must, I to be the waiting dust beyond the sorrow, pain, or lust, and to forever truly one now there you go now uh, thanks um, so uh am going to so he'll um, uh, or on the I'll um, carry on now. So, should can in my so or on that random on Skelpin Drynoch, I guess, um, Lagan will be a column of Creon. Um, so, um, a, a version of Skelpin Drynoch uh, that I heard from uh, Column of Creon, who's a um, a great, great singer from from near uh, near Corna and um. Seamus Ennis collected over two two hundred songs from him, uh, and uh, some really great great versions of songs as well. He had this amazing kind of rhythm as well, and kind of even on the slow songs, he kind of sang them a bit bit bit, bit faster and with more kind of rhythm in them. So, um, but yeah, this is Skelpin Drynoch. The story of it, it's about um, a fella who, well, he's in love with this uh, woman, but she, her family are I think are are more wealthy. They have a and there's a great line in it: "Love, please don't abandon me because of sheep or cattle." Um, but um, anyway, it doesn't doesn't work out. So he he, he goes off and uh, he joins the he joins the army. Then after that, so bad decisions all around. I think so. Anyway, um, I'll take these off altogether. So. And as mine in younger eyed am a mach we broch na gaze. Es geht zu gewollt und sei daran zu leis nie alle fall. We brauch nüch gelbe drein, er schei erg men rünn jo eigli. Angus jetzt mach rüh 
Just, I'll, I'll do a little short one just for while I'm thinking about the next one. <laughs> um, the, it just a lag and go uh, walk through my hair machine. Um, so one we all learned in school, but um, walk through my hair machine. But um, this is a kind of a groovier version that Sean O'Connor and Ted Allen did, I think so. Uh, um, uh, let me see. <laughs> Ramochrimo, <laughs> <laughs> 
So that's uh, sorry, I forgot to say I forgot I was thinking about doing that. That's a, a real Alice is real uh was is the name of that. Uh I think probably do we have one more or Yep. Can I want the last show? Yeah, okay. Um Sure yeah, look, I'll I'll, I'll make use of the Constantina thing as I have it. Uh this um Uh, this song I wrote myself about a year ago called um, uh, The Deepest Breath. Um. <laughs> Did you dream last night, child? Did your dreams stay with you? Oh, the city sucks the wild from your mind So hold your dream before it hits you And wear your dreams, they're all that fit you We dig these graves now every day Eternal homes denied in lifetime And the rich men wave our lives away Can't see a soul without a price tag Did you dream last night, child? Did your dream stay with you? Oh, this town can burn the bright of your mind so hold your dream before it hits you And wear your dreams, they're all that fit you Oh, sing, friend, if you have a song to sing For your songs are a glimpse of a flickering freedom And we're not yet spent, we have a world to win and there'll be no king, but it'll be our kingdom. Did you dream last night, child? Did your dream stay with you? Oh, this land can leech the light from your life. So hold your dream before it hits you. And wear your dreams, they're all that fit you. And when you sing on, oh Lord, you've got songs aplenty. Oh, they'll try to tear the truth from your mouth. So sing on strong, make sure they felt it. Oh, sing on, oh Lord, oh, so oh, empty. Oh, sing on, sing on, in your songs, raise your sunny, so cold. Dream on, dream 
dream on our dreams at the deepest breath we draw. Sing on, sing on in your sun place the highest hope of all. Dream on, dream on our dreams at the deepest breath we draw. Sing on, sing on in your sun place the highest hope of all. Dream on, dream on our dreams at the deepest breath we draw. Our dreams at the deepest breath. We draw. Thanks. Um. Lovely stuff, Owen. Thank you very much. Well, guys, with that, we will take our 10-minute uh, break, as is customary for this time. Uh, what I'll do is give you the ability to unmute yourselves, and, uh, yeah, we'll see you in 10 if you need to go to the bathroom or do whatever else. Uh, you can uh, unmute and say hi, but just remember you are being broadcast to the world. <laughs> so... <laughs> Make of that what you will. Here's in a few. The lilting one was super fun. Thanks yeah. very much. Cheers. <laughs> it's a bit of a bit of crack, right? Yeah. yeah. <laughs> that last one was excellent. Really enjoyed that. Thank you. Cheers. Much appreciated. Thanks. Um, yeah. Where did you say that last one was from, Owen? Oh, it's one of my own. Um, it is? Yeah, yeah. That's yeah. gorgeous. Oh, thanks a lot. Cheers. Is that recent? Um, it's about a year ago now, yeah. Uh, Have you recorded it? Uh, it's on YouTube. I'm planning on recording it uh, next month, it's actually. So, <laughs> oh, my gosh. Um, it's so but, uh, beautiful. Thanks. Thanks very much. Cheers. Um, mm -hmm. Your little it's film on. was great going as well. Thanks a million. Um, yeah, that, trying to trying to bring the old Lilton back. There's a few. <laughs> there's a few few of us now yeah. in uh, Stony Batter are thinking of starting up a Lilting Lilting choir at some point. But uh, when we, wow, <laughs> that would be amazing. <laughs> we haven't got around to it yet, but hopefully. Um, there's a there's a Lilton festival in Tyrone. Oh, yeah, I was actually at it there. Um, when was I at it? Was it maybe just before the, probably the, the last, probably twenty nineteen, probably the last one that was on before the, the pandemic. Um, it was great fun, Jesus, and dancers and all. We 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 um, because uh yeah, I, yeah I got to, me Seamus O'Kane isn't anything to you. Uh, no, that Seamus Grassy no. Sorry. It would be no, it would be seven generations ago. But no, yeah. sorry, but I don't know if my connection there, but I, I, I broke up on me. But I think, I, think I, was, I was at the I was at that festival anyway. Um, uh, probably the last time I was on, there's a bunch of different dancers and and um, uh, Catherine Tinney was over from Scotland and. Uh, Got to lilt with Seamus Faye as well, which was great, a great experience. Mm -hmm. But uh, yeah, I'd love to go back. Um, well, if it's on next year, like I'll make the trip up. <laughs> Good run, Grant, to, to you. Uh, here to let enjoy harp on now as well. Great, yeah, yeah, great. <laughs> Good stuff. Um, I'm just going to run and get, grab a cup of tea. I'll be back with you. Just going to say, folks, uh, same as when, I, when we started, I, I will uh, nudge a few of you in the chat section to sing the first couple of songs of the second half. Uh, so just keep an eye on the chat. Everything sounds good to me. Thanks, everyone. Agreed.
Hi Alice Farrell Perma, I didn't see you come in. Good to see you. Good to see you too. I ran away from George Murphy. Yeah. <laughs> I, I, I can't I can never tell if you're if you're on one knitting project or multiple on these calls. Is this is this something you've been working on like progressively? Are we gonna see it like by the end of like a, a year of the session? Are we gonna see a jumper or something? Oh no, this is um I just finished one shawl and now I'm making another one. Amazing. Yeah. Um I've been doing a series I was doing like for, I did, I think I did since the mm -hmm. beginning of the lockdown, mm -hmm. I've done five baby blankets to different babies. And uh, now I just got some uh, yarn recently. So I'm making shawls out of that. And then uh, Deirdre, you know, uh, Deirdre Bialo Padin, who comes mm -hmm. on here, mm -hmm. she's going to teach me how to make, uh, these wonderful Shetland cats. So that you'll probably see for a while because I've never done it before. <laughs> They're really cute though. They're really, really cute. <laughs> they are. Yeah. yeah. I believe that uh, Lynn Phipps uh, is the, or, or no, Eleni is the proud owner of yeah, one that yep. Deirdre just posted on her Facebook page that she made one for Laney. Yeah. So I downloaded the pattern and she's going to start walking me through it. So I'm very excited. <laughs> then he's gone off to get it yeah it's a great little pattern i will say um i like i like the shawl pattern that you're working on though actually That's yeah lovely. this is it's called a lacy shawl this yeah. i'm crocheting at the moment yeah go back I, and forth i do not knit or crochet but um i went to the yarn store with my younger sister who does and impulse bought a bunch of lace weight um uh yarn that is quite lovely it's a very similar color to that um uh -huh. but i don't know what i'm ever going to do with it it's been sitting in a box ever <laughs> well i don't know if you can see but this is a one of these gradient balls like it goes down and you know oh, that's to a lighter color and then a lighter and lighter but yeah. um i will tell you anybody in dublin and i've told this to emma who is always commenting that uh, my friend uh Maureen Christopher has a great shop called Loza, L-O-Z-A, Loza Wool in Clendalkin. So if anybody in Dublin is looking for great buys and classes and all that, go check her out. And there, I think Elaine is back with the hat. I do that hat and everything, Alice, but you just weren't paying attention. Oh, you did? I was, I was, I, sorry. Dara is so dazzling today. I was just looking at him. Here is the beautiful hat. Oh, absolutely. It suits you so well. It fits perfectly. It's a good job. Yeah, great job. All in blues. And it's got, you can't really see while it's on my head. Oh, sugar moon, it's caught in an earring. Hang on a minute. <laughs> um, it's got, uh, look at we sort of, star pattern thing at the top yeah that's I mean, the same pattern i'm gonna to learn nor nor do i want to be really especially when people send me gorgeous knitting but um i was looking on the inside just going what the heck has the woman done it's a work of genius. <laughs> work of genius. yeah you don't want to look at the wrong side <laughs> no, no it looks amazing i mean I've, i'm just i'm quite full of admiration for how she's done it yeah it's a mystery. Well, folks, we may have to leave uh, the, the knitting uh, intricate Whoa. chat to uh, to somewhere near the end now. We have to get going for the second half. But no, I, excuse I, I, me, I, you I, started it. It sounds like I'm mocking. I'm really, I'm really not. No, no, no. It's, it's, genu it's genuinely interesting. Uh, but we just have to keep the show <laughs> on the road. Unfortunately, no, honestly. Uh, anyway, um, we are going to kick off again. Um, First up, we are going to have Bill Dunlap, who uh, was queued up to sing the first half. He had to run off unexpectedly. Followed by Bill, we will have uh, Paul O'Hay. And third up, we will have Sandy. So, Bill, I've asked to unmute you. Have we got Bill? Has Bill run away? He was there. He just got up and ran off screen. Oh dear. Okay. Well, I tell you what. The the O'Hay uh, brothers, I think, uh, they have to run off shortly. So why don't I get those guys up, and then we can uh, find Bill when he comes back. Paul, I'm going to ask to unmute you to accept my unmuting. We have you. How are you? 
not too bad. Uh, Colin from Armagh, is it? Yeah, well, Paul's my dad. Oh, there we go, okay. I'm out. Hey, Liam's away to get him now. What song will I do, Liam? I'll just do a song. This song is by Finmar McGee. It's called My Belfast Love. Great stuff. And like a jewel shone Her sapphire eyes did hypnotize And cast upon me a spell On those ruby lips that I longed to kiss But had no nerve to tell You are my Belfast love And there are none above stuff thank you so much for that and right. uh, i believe this is your first time but you're welcome here any third saturday of the month uh, you've got you've got a, a, f a friend group of singers here they'll be happy to hear you anytime okay thanks very much great stuff okay um we will head on now um over to sandy bill has not returned yet uh, though he is displaying a wonderful bookcase there uh sandy i'm gonna oh yeah we have you sandy how are you hi i'm good where are you calling from Cleveland, Ohio, USA. <laughs> beautiful, a beautiful city. I've been on, on a number of occasions. Uh, what's the weather there like at the moment? It's actually a lovely day today. It's about it's about 45. It's sunny. Great it's stuff. lovely. Great. And what are you <laughs> going to sing for us? Um, I'm going to sing a song called The Flower of Maharelli. Great. 
one pleasant summer's morning when all the flowers were springing oh nature was adorning and the wee bird sweetly singing oh i met my love near bambridge town my charming blue-eyed sally oh she's the queen of the county down the flower of my <laughs> with admiration i did gaze upon this blue-eyed maiden oh adam wasn't half so much pleased when he met eve in eden oh her skin was like a lily white that grows in yonder valley oh she's the queen and my heart's delight the flower of my her yellow hair in ringlets clung her shoes were spanish leather oh her bonnet with blue ribbons strung, her scarlet cap and feather roll. Like Venus bright, she did appear, this charming blue-eyed lassie, oh. She's the one that I love, dear. The flower of Mahorelli, and I hope the day will surely come when we'll join hands together. Oh, tis then I'll bring my true love home, in spite of wind or weather. Oh. And let them all say what they will, and let them reel and rally, oh, for I shall wed the girl I love, the flower of Mahorelli, oh. Mighty stuff, Sandy. Thank you so much. And you're welcome back anytime. Thank you. Uh, okay, we'll take a, a short journey up the road, not too far, uh, from Cleveland, Ohio to Toronto, Canada. Uh, <laughs> and hear from Kathleen McDonald. Kathleen, I'm going to ask to unmute you. We have you, Kathleen. Oh, How are wow. You? Thank you. <laughs> I, I'm good. I, I didn't expect to hear. Sorry, I hear sent you. <laughs> you a private message. Sometimes people don't see them in time. But uh, Oh, no, I did. But I thought, oh, I'd have to just wait a while. But okay. Uh, thank you very much. No worries. Um, okay, I, I'm going to do a song called Drimmin' Down, um, and it has, uh, it's, some of you are probably familiar with it, it has a chorus that's part in Irish, and I learned that by, you know, just phonetically, and uh, people here like it, but some of you may think I've bangled the language, so please forgive me. <laughs> Not at all. Dreaming down lived before she was dead. She gave me sweet butter to spread on me bread. Likewise, good milk for to stiffen me crown. And now it's black water since Dreaming Down's gone. I get sorrow, Dreaming Down, oh, for oh, ha. I get sorrow, Dreaming Down, near you, bra. I get sorrow, Dreaming Down. Oh, no, Tiago, son, oh, my dreaming down, Daddy. Oh, where have you gone? Dreaming down, dreaming down, witching for a while. Dreaming down, dreaming down, what made you die? So white was your milk, 
and so sleek was your tail that I thought my dreaming down never would fail. I could sort of dream down all for all heart. Sort of dreaming down near you grow. Sort of dreaming down, oh, no, Tia Gosman, oh, I dreaming down, daddy. Oh, where have you gone? Dreaming down's gone and I'll see her no more. Back on an island close down by the shore. And after she sank, well, she rose up again like a bunch of wild blackberries grown in the land. I thought I'll dream down over over. Thought I'll dream it down till you cry. Sort of dream down, oh no, Chiago Sun, oh my dreaming down, daddy, oh where have you gone? Oh my dreaming down, daddy, oh where have you gone? Wonderful stuff, Kathleen. Thanks so much. Yeah, no, that's, a, that's a great song. Um, I wonder if you're familiar at all with the Fire Drawn Near podcast. No. Well, a great, no. a, a great singer and a song researcher, Ian Lynch in Dublin, has a, a podcast. And he actually, in a recent episode, went through all the various iterations of Andrumman Down Delish, that song, and uh, where it's cropped up in, uh, in very strange ways. I'll put a link to it in the chat. And, uh, oh, check, I'd check love that. Yes, yeah. it's got an interesting history. Uh... <laughs> complicated thank you thank you absolutely okay uh well we will move on now to ted miller i don't believe we've had ted on the call before but glad to have new people ted i've asked to unmute you i can see it. <laughs> i can see ted's finger dancing around the screen here doesn't seem to be coming up with the goods okay. there we go <laughs> how are you ted good and where are you calling from uh, Pulaski, Pennsylvania. I'm about 60 miles from Cleveland. Okay. Okay. And what are you going to actually us? help with the Cleveland Irish festival? Ah, okay. 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 And, and the Pittsburgh. I, I presume so. that, I presume that's not going to happen this year. Uh, it's, it might be in the works. Okay. So, yeah, well, um, wish, wishing you all the best in that, in that regard. What are you going to sing for us, Ted? Well, uh, I always like Tommy Makem songs and one that, uh, I, I really like is, uh, Gentle Annie. Lovely. Fair and lovely Annie, your gentle ways have won me. You bring peace and joy and laughter everywhere. Where you go, the sunshine follows. You're a breath of spring in winter. And my heart and soul are always in your care. Gentle Annie. Gentle Annie, and my heart and soul are always in your care. When the mountains all come tumbling, when the earth has stopped its turning, when the winds don't blow and stars refuse to shine, when the rivers stop their turning, and the mountains stop their growing. I will still have gentle Annie on my mind. Gentle Annie, gentle Annie. I will still have gentle Annie on my mind. You're a flower among the flowers. You're the earth song in the morning. You're the laughter of the children at their play. You're my faith, my hope, my wisdom. You're my reason just for living. You're my treasure, you're my very night and day. Gentle Annie, gentle Annie. You're my treasure, you're my very night and day. I screwed up a verse. Nothing, nothing screwed up about that at all, Ted. That was lovely. Thank you so much. Uh, thanks. Yeah, please, please, don't be a stranger. That was that was great. Oh, thanks. Okay. Um, we are going to move on now. I sent a message to Eamon O'Flynn, but I'm not sure if you saw it. Eamon, I'll ask to unmute you. I have to mute me. 
Eamon, do we have you? I can see him negotiating the buttons. There we go, Eamon. How are there you? Not too bad. You haven't been waiting long, have you? <laughs> <laughs> I don't mind that. Enjoying, I'm enjoying the night, and yet, yes, yeah. Yeah, yeah. What are you yeah. going to sing for us? Uh, the Bunny Bunch of Roses, though. Gorgeous. Take it away. <clears throat> By the margin of the ocean, one pleasant evening in the month of June, when all those feathered songsters there are liquid notes in its sweetly tune. There I spied a female. She seemed to be in grief and woe, conversing with young born apart, concerning the bunny bones of roses all. But love spoke young about young, and takes his mother by the hand. Say, mother dear, be patient until I'm able to command. There I will raise an army and throw tremendous dangers go. And I'd never will return again till I conquer the bunny bones of roses all. He told three hundred thousand men, we kings like wise to bear his slave. He was so well provided for that he could sweep the world alone. But when he came to Moscow, he was overpowered by the driven snow. And Moscow was a blazing, so he lost his bunny bones of roses all. No sun made months of winter sun, for England is the heart of all. And Ireland, Scotland, England, where unity shall ne'er be born. Remember your dear father. Men say to me, as he lies low, and all you follow, sir, beware of the bunny bones of roses all. Anyway. Lovely stuff, Eamon. I, I would associate that mostly with, with Frank Hard. Is that where you learned it from? Sorry, I didn't get that now. I was saying I, was saying I associate that, that that song and that version with, with Frank Hard mostly. Is that, is that where you learned it? Always got to hit. Try that again now. <laughs> I was just wondering if, if you uh, gotten that version from Frank Hart. That's who I associate the song with. No, no, no I didn't. No, I should not. I... I I actually don't know. The mother used to sing a lot of those songs. Oh, that's that's a good enough, that's a good enough answer as any. My mother used to. Yeah. Say. Yes. 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 Well, thanks very much, Eamon. And thank you very much. Very we'll good. Move on now to uh, Alberta Laffin. Alberta, I will ask to unmute you. We have Alberta. How are you, Alberta? I'm good. It's so great to be here. I always enjoy it so much. It's great to have Wonderful. you. Wonderful. Great to have you. How's the weather where you are? Uh, it is, uh, spring is, is trying to get here. <laughs> That's about what I have to say. Yeah. What are you <laughs> going to sing for us? Well, this is called Banos Bright Blue Bay. Uh, it's about a, a sort of a, a, a buried city that, you know, probably may or may not have actually been a buried city. But for the purposes of this song, it existed. <clears throat> um, 
I've roved through many an Irish scene where nature fairest dwells. Through sweet of August Vale I've been and fair Killarney spells. But as your farm, my memory keeps one scene more loved than they where fan buried city lies beneath that bright blue bay and often in the harvest time when rose the harvest moon i've listened to the church bells chime and heard the reaper's tune on Banos Burr, whose murmurs deep make music all the day, as all around the city sleeps beneath that bright blue bay. And often in the harvest time, sorry, they say the ancient city stood long centuries ago when now we watch the fitful flood and the bright blue waters flow from Kieran's ancient ivy shrine to Banos Abbey Gray Too far gone minds a very city lay. One midnight as the moon went down behind Ralph Donnell Hill, and all the merry making town full many a feast did fill. Stormy sea above it broke, and since that fatal day, the very city never woke beneath that bright blue bay. And now they say that it doth lie beneath its shroud of foam. And to mourn their ancient city's loss, the peasants love to roam. And often in the evening time, those phantom shrieks they say are heard beneath the tranquil waves of the nose bright blue bay. I've roved through many an Irish scene where nature fairest dwells. Through woodland scenes and valleys green, through mountains, lakes, and fells. A pressure farm my memory keeps one place more loved than they. Where Banos buried city lies beneath that bright blue bay. Lovely stuff, Alberta. Thanks so much. Remind me the name of that song? Banos Bright Blue Bay. And where does it come from? Uh, well, it comes from Wexford. Mm -hmm. And there, there is a place where it probably just silted up over the centuries. I mean, I don't think it just disappeared one day or was dropped into the ocean. <laughs> I think it took hundreds of years to make the city disappear. And it yes, was just it, paired it, with a new, a different air. So. Yes, I, Wexford's lost city of Atlantis or something like that in, in, in equivalent. Yes. Great stuff. Uh, okay, uh, next up, I have sent a message to Patricia Ryan. Um, I'm not sure if she saw my message, but I'll ask to unmute her and see if she's fit for a song, Patricia. 
Do we have you? Hmm. Uh, Max Ari, yeah, I'm sorry that I didn't uh, make I'm not a singer this day. I, I, you, you broke up there, but but I think I gathered from it that you, that, that you, you're, you wouldn't like to sing, so no worries. Um, I will move on. So to Alice Farrell Perman. Alice, sorry to catch you on the hop like this, but uh, I know I know you're a consummate professional and well. Uh, you always love to catch me on the hop. <laughs> <laughs> there, there, there's some people can take it better than others, Alice. It's a, it's a compliment that I would call you. Oh, on the hop. thank you. I'm I'm so thrilled to hear that. All right, well, this is what I got from the singing of Rita Gallagher, The Lament to the Moon. <clears throat> As I strayed along at the close of the day, about the beginning of June, was there in a glade I espied a fair maid as she sang her lament to the moon. Roll along, silvery moon, guide the traveler on his way, whilst the nightingale sings a sweet tune. There is no time so sweet as when true lovers meet by the bright silvery light of the moon. My love, he was young and a bold fisherman. His arms were brawny and strong. His voice was clear and a pleasure to hear when singing an old shanty song. But his boat went down, and my true love had found a grave neath a deep, angry sea, never more to return. And it's for him I'll mourn till the day that the clay covers me. <clears throat> he bought me a ring. We appointed the day t'was married. We were to be soon, but alas, to my grief, he now lies neath the deep, cut down like a rose in full bloom. Roll along, silvery moon, will guide the traveler on his way, whilst the nightingale sings a sweet tune. There is no time so sweet as when true lovers meet, by the bright silvery light of the moon there is no time so sweet as when true lovers meet by the bright silvery light of the moon Sinead. Well, I tell you something, Alice, you wove that song together uh, every bit as well as that tapestry on your knee. Gorgeous, gorgeous. <laughs> Thank you so much. You're a meal of mahogany. <laughs> 
Uh, okay, uh, well, Lani Mid Arai, Lashon E Specialty, we will move ahead with the special guest, Mr. Owen Okanawan. Owen, I will unmute you again. And the floor is yours, Okara. Uh, thanks very much. Uh, great, great to hear all the songs tonight. Really, really nice to. I haven't actually been at a, a singing session in a long time, so it's been, it's been really nice to listen to people. Um, yeah, I, 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 uh, let me see. The second half uh, goes. Sad, playful, sad, happy, and then finishes kind of mellow out, I hope. So <laughs> try and get through these. Um, uh, the first one I'll try is, is uh, one called Bohor Chloe Mala, and I got it from um, Niklas Tobin, um, one of my, my favourite singers. And it's about um, the story of it. Well, the story, the version I have of it anyway, um, there's probably other ver- versions that uh, are a bit different, but uh, it's a, it's about a, a man whose his wife is, is very ill and um, he goes walking the roads looking for um, a doctor and uh, before before he finds anybody uh, she passes away but her, her 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 ghost her spirit comes and appears before him and uh, kind of disguised as a beautiful uh, woman and he doesn't recognize her and she she basically is tempting him saying you know if if you leave your wife um, I'll have you know you can you'll have loads of land you can be with me and um loads of land and gold and cows and all that good stuff and um uh, he, he anyway he, he he um responds he says he, he refuses he says he uh i think the last last verse or the last line of it is um he says he'll, he'll never love anyone except the mother of his children so it's uh <laughs> in mala Geist der Father, how 
Ja, du er digger et folk i gass og brylleskarpe. Angus meidon går om rød hel blant labo. Ni hjokkets stål for søv. Ist mor in storm hängt, ist mor lang i bang och vägen var han har. Mår går mår i dagen, i dagen. This is something else. So, should can a or on the frog. So, this is a kind of a more humorous song. So, it's, it's uh, written uh, uh, relatively recent. Um, uh, written by uh, Michael Vartle, um, uh, from Bontrachard, uh, just up the road from where my dad is. Uh, it's from, and uh, so um, or on the frog. It's a song about about uh, basically this this frog that. Got into the house one of the nights, and um, they had a huge kind of a battle uh, trying to get rid of it. So that's you know, um, but they, they they also back then they they believed that um, the frog was uh, a banshee. So the um, the song is kind of um, written about this kind of big battle about to get this banshee out of the house that she came in, and she had her um, she had a sword and a shield and a cloak, and um, they were all kind of tearing lumps out of of each other for the night. But they're actually they're just trying to get rid of this frog that got into the house. So. Um, here we go. Uh, it's one I, I got from my dad, so... Um. Alright, honey, true, we shall go on, let it um, yon, he. It's the reader, hench, bam, oh, oh, a cut, oh, and she. Marshu di rohan gas palm wet si yaros lana sil Shneve bow al rohan no madin Mahagun shi no si Shneve rohan no go go alam wet Don shul shtach sa trait Sa khur shni na gar od nach maju vi we clive if we the house could lose falling a bride. Said a nose of a lash, Kioch, be she a husband in the life. Swan tread and keen, you do snee, his cattle, I knew yon. And if for the tea, oh, he got tea. In Gary Hill, yes, Jack Nabini Ryan Wabunyan. I hold the real to speed his cream. Nihoda, he your love. Sneel fair, a big awarly, or to you, you's a night. We she borrow, we war as Nahina, Kuria, she a brawl. Then a fear of father for a struggling rogan was a guardian. She near a big amorici, after she got in her eye. Ah, still father go on flower talk. Go brachni na rochetin, marni ne norgas priagunye na khnyartiche gazin, 
Frog in a club. <laughs> I've seen some of the comments coming in. Yeah, um, yeah. It was it was there was a big old battle anyway. So, um, right. I'll, I'll try. I'll try one in English now. Um, there's another one of my own songs. Um, and um, it's called All Our Lonely Ghosts. I've just got to fire into it. See how it goes. So. It was last night that a woman went to calling to unmarked grace, heart silent as a tomb, remembering how they told her she had fallen. Because of who she carried in her womb, because of who they taken from her of the tomb. Oh, my lost child, I have come to find you. No prayer for you, for I no longer pray. Oh, I belong, long morning for you. And now I stand upon your grave, where you lie cold. Among eight hundred little babes. Now they say that these scandals are all over. So clean the slate and close the book of names. They clench their fists and keep their faces sombre and sleep at night at ease with their refrain. Those muttered words of never again. But I've been thinking. And I been a walkin on Dublin streets past all these darkened doorways. See bodies slow, hear voices nearby talking of hostile rooms, a blanket and spare change, and the bare bleak day breaks on them where they lay. Last week I saw another rambling mother her child in hand, turning through the streets. Now well none's home for her, no Christian brother. Only cold open sky 
entire tramping feet. Small hope to spare that soon they might walk free. Now there's a voice at, at another grave. He must be great brave now that his father's gone. His dad he tried to find another way. But the landlord came to sing eviction songs. And the rope was strong, he didn't suffer long. No mass graves in our new Ireland, no more. No hidden tools. Or crosses etched in bone for the body scatter all round us on street corners and the hanging lonely rooms of desolated homes. No company for these ghosts they fly alone thanks um thanks very much um i'm gonna uh i think i'll sh yeah shake off that now with just a bit of linton and then maybe do one more to finish off uh if that's all right um so i'll do it just two two reels um the first one is the Kalani Boys of Pleasure, and the second one is My Lovers in America, I think. Finish up, uh, um, um, 
I'll use this thing again. It's been thinking about <laughs> breathe. Thanks. Um, he always uh, yeah. Anyway, people. That's the concina, by the way. If anyone's wondering, I was thinking this is probably like the ver the musicians um, uh, version of you know TV TV presenters not wearing any trousers, like but you're hearing sound coming out, but you're not sure what what, what it's uh, what it's coming from. But it's coming from this this concina. Um, I'll, I'll try one, one last one with, with that and it's it's, a, it's one, another one of my own but it, it, one in Irish this time it's called um, On Oil Wan Heilsche and Bon Heilsche is a, is a I suppose my dad told me that his, his mother used to say the um, amount of is a man Heilsche um, it's kind of I was up with the like literally the white lights but it's the very kind of um, very kind of early morning like before the kind of sun sun has risen, risen I suppose Um and um, Onal is breath, so it's kind of like fir first light, light's breath is, is the name of the song. Uh, Onal, one hail, she's like.
thanks very much um, um and thanks many to just i forgot to say before i finished but thanks so much to the shameless in this art center for having me and um th thanks for listening and, and it was great to hear everybody's songs and, and really nice to be in a, in a session anyway uh once again for being a, being a while so yeah i uh, really enjoyed the, the night and uh, hope you're all keeping safe thank you well, it's Oren Ata on Honor on it. The honor is all ours, and thanks so much for uh, joining us this evening. Uh, we will get a couple of more songs before we say officially good night. Uh, also, we are slightly short on singer this evening, so one or two of you will be asked to sing a second song. So if you thought the deed was done, be afraid, be very afraid. <laughs> well, first, we'll have uh, Brie Kelly. Brie, I'm going to ask to unmute you. How are you, Brie? I'm good. How are you? Not too bad at all. What do you, what do you have for us? Uh, well, this has been stuck in my head since we talked yesterday, so um, I'm going to give you a Utah Phillips song from uh, the Rocky Mountain Mines um, in the U.S., um, and it's uh, a favorite of mine. I have, I've seen these tins, actually. I worked in a mining museum for a little while, um, so I've actually seen these tins, um, although I can't vouch for the accuracy of the sort of larger narrative, but it's a favorite of mine, so. Once long ago he was handsome and tall and fit to be called to the wars we left our home family and all ne'er to return anymore now he takes his coat his bucket and lamp and he whistles his way to the cave where men young and old from all over the camp gather in search of a wage. Husband, sleep, lay your head back and dream. A slow falling leaf borne down to the stream, carried away on the wings of morphine. Homeward for over the sea. My husband and I, we are Roman in faith, and we have a secret to keep. If ever his life it was taken away, then gentle and long will he sleep. Now some men pass with family around on blankets and linen so clean, but seldom a miner will go underground without his tin of morphine. Husband sleep, lay your head back and dream, a slow falling leaf borne down to the stream carried away on the wings of morphine homeward far over the sea now there is work an explosion is heard the miners are trapped underground if any survive down there alive i'm certain we never will know Although our families have vainly appealed, no rescue attempt can be seen. All hope for our loved ones in the dark earth sealed now rests in a tin of morphine. Husband, sleep, lay your head back and dream. A slow falling leaf borne down to the stream carried away on the wings of morphine homeward far over the sea lovely stuff Bray. thank you so much uh okay we will move over now to Anne parsons dunn who's agreed to sing us a song and i've asked to unmute you hey. we have you okay i'm going to try and sing a song my father liked. Lovely. Spring is here, spring is here. Life is skittles and life is beer. I think the loveliest time of the year is the spring. 
I do, don't you? Of course you do. But there's one thing that makes life complete for me and makes every Sunday a treat for me. All oh, the world is in tune on a spring afternoon when we're poisoning pigeons in the park. Every Sunday you see my sweetheart and me as we poison the pigeons in the park. When they see us coming, the birdies all try and hide, but they still go for peanuts when coated in cyanide. The sun's shining bright, everything is all right when we're poisoning pigeons in the park. Da 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 We've gained notoriety and caused much anxiety in the humane society with our games. They call it impiety and lack of propriety and quite a variety of unpleasant names. But it's not against any religion to want to dispose of a pigeon. So if Sunday you're free, why don't you come with me and we'll poison the pigeons in the park. And maybe we'll do in a squirrel or two while we're poisoning pigeons in the park. We'll murder them all amid laughter and merriment, except for the few that we take home for experiment. My pulse will be quickening with each drop of strychnine we feed to a pigeon. It just takes a smidgen to poison a pigeon in the park. Da 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 da. My father's favourite song. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> that was wonderful. Ad. Absolutely wonderful. It put me in mind. It's a humour. Remember. Yeah. I can't. I can't remember the name of the the Dublin City Councillor who who remarked uh, recently that <laughs> the seagulls of Dublin have lost the run of themselves. <laughs> Lovely. <laughs> that was that was great. So thank you for them. Yeah, and, and great to hear you. you. Okay, uh, we'll head over now to Mr. David Polacek. David, I'll ask to unmute you. We have you. There we go. How are you? I'm well, thank you. In Austin, Texas, and. Uh, having a wonderful time tonight at this wonderful session. Nice. Uh, thanks for calling on me. Uh, I'm going to sing just a uh, brief poem by William Butler Yeats. It's one of his uh, poems of unrequited love. And he called it, He Wishes for the Cloths of Heaven. And the tune I'll use to sing it, I selected is, I will give my love a breast of glass. And I've got my hidden concertina here to give me the note. And I, and I the heavens embroidered cloths inwrought with golden and silver light. The blue and the dim and the dark cloths of night and light and the half light i would spread those cloths under your feet but i being poor have only my dreams i have spread my dreams under your feet tread softly because you tread on my dreams. Lovely, David. Thank you very much. Short and sweet. Um, okay, uh, I'm going to call on two singers now uh, because it was my uh, my personal opinion that singing half a song was not quite enough. <laughs> so I'll first ask uh, Connor to sing the first song, uh, then Elaine, and then we may have time for uh, me to sing a, a rare song as part of the evening. So uh, I'll unmute Connor first. Connor, how are you? Uh, uh, 
Oh yeah, I am. I am unmuted. Thank you, you very much. I thought we got away with that one there. Three verses. Was it not good enough for you? <laughs> it was definitely good enough, not quite long enough. Right, that's fair. Uh, right, I'm not. I'm not even going to respond to that one. <laughs> right, uh, no, well, it's uh, that Utah Phillips song is brilliant. I love Utah Phillips. He's amazing. Um, and yeah, to hear a song about mining, put this one onto my head, and and this is kind of this is an anti mining song, all the way from the Sperrins. So, uh, and it's based on the the. The Big Rock Candy Mountain, which I've heard Utah Phillips do that as well. So that's where that's where we're gonna try and tie it all together. Anyway, I'll sing the song. One evening as the sun went down, this man come up early. He said he was my neighbor, but from Canada he came and he asked me if I'd like this sup. From the radians money fountain, I cause up in the hills, you're just sticking on the drills, and they say that there's a fortune lying under Gorchin in the heart of the spare and mountains. Sing a rum needle da 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 rum needle da 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 rum needle da da rum needle da go. It is in golden nuggets. And it is in golden dust, and it's not some old prospector we is dungarees rolled up. Oh, it's twenty thousand tons of rock that they carted out and trucked. There's no harm in packs like a boost in the tax and a wean of jobs for the working slobs. The prophets head away. You'd really want to pray for the heart of the spare and mountains. Sing a rum little da 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 rum little da 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 rum little da 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 rum little da. Oh, they say the gold is needed for the fingers of the world. Sure, if we did not have this gold, no boy could wed his girl. Ah, but here's the only streams in Ulster muscles yield the pearls and the oak and the ash and the rowan tree. Shelter the bluebells and blaberries, and the salmon and the otters for one another in the heart of the barren mountains. Singing rum diddly da 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 rum diddly da 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 rum diddly da da rum diddly da da And the Owen Kilu River flows on the meet the stream. And with the dare they make them more not lively sparkle and jewel. And sure it flows north, they meet the fun, and thus becomes the foil. Now you take some pop, they screw on up, but if anybody can, well it's already on. The DOE says it's grand be me, in the heart of the spare and mountains. Rum diddle da, da rum diddle da. Rum diddle da, da rum diddle day, da rum diddle da, da da rum, da 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 rum diddle da, da rum diddle do. Well, I tell that stranger where to go, why I can't agree. Slurry pets of cyanide and a torn community. For the love and streams and the dream and hells, they are treasures we can't forsake. But as he lumped away, boys, I swear I heard him say, someday you'll scrake, cause you never got your bacon, that gold boom cake. Well, this made me shake, so I raised my stake off Holly Cliff. Of a brave you left, and I made my speak. Now we know yins are fake, but you're never gonna break the heart of the spare and mountains. Singing rum de de da 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 rum de da 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 rum de da da rum de da 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 rum de da 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 rum de da da rum de da 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 rum de da da. No matter what you take. Yins are never gonna break 
the heart of the sparrow mountains. <laughs> Wonderful, Connor. Let it not be said that we are a lilting, exclusionary song session. We will, we have it all here. That was absolutely mighty, Connor. Thank you so much. Thank okay, you. we 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 creep ever closer towards the end. I shall unmute Lainey Dempsey to sing the second last song of the evening. Lainey, how are you? Second last. Happy to hear that. And um, I'm good. Thanks. Woohoo, Connor! That was brilliant. Loved it. Thank you. Um. I couldn't be about to sing a more different song, right enough. Uh, you've lifted us all up, you take us back down. Seeing as I'm feeling, uh, I'm feeling quite sleepy, just back from work today, so I'm going to sing a song about a hangover. This is a Cyril Tony song. Too soon to be out of my bed too soon to be back at this bus queue keeper. Fumbling for change for my picture paper on a Monday morning. Wrong end of the week. For a smile, wrong end of the day for being civil. There's many's an angel would be a devil on a Monday morning. Oh, where is the weekend now? Where is the whiskey and beer I tasted? Gone the same way as the pay I wasted on a Monday morning. If only the birds would booze. If only the sun was a party giver. If I could just lend someone else my liver on a Monday morning. My lover, he lies asleep. My lover is warm and his heart is mellow. I trade you the world just to share his pillow. On a Monday morning. That's it. Oh my God. Oh my God. How beautiful. Uh, there was one or two people asking uh, in uh, the comment section there who wrote this song. It was, of course, uh, Cyril Tawney. Mm -hmm. uh, that was absolutely fabulous, Lenny. Thank you so much for that. Uh, uh, all the harder to, to follow, I should say. I regret my, my, my earlier commitment to. Oh, to you must, you must. <laughs> <laughs> great stuff well folks that just about brings us uh, to the end of another month here at the Seamus Ennis Art Centre uh, as usual can we just give a huge uh, thank you and uh, virtual applause for Mr. Owen O'Kanawan I've let you unmute temporarily there to give it to honour thanks for all your, your songs uh, I really enjoyed okay. tonight so. Great stuff. Um, and also, uh, as we say, uh, usually at the end of each month, uh, the Seamus Ennis Arts Centre, like every other uh, independent arts organisation in the country, is struggling uh, through this time. So if this session tonight was worth 
a few quid to get the price of a pint, whatever, and you have that to spare, there is a PayPal link here in the Zoom chat. There's also one in the YouTube and Facebook chat. If you have a few quid to spare, if you haven't been too financially hit by all of this uh, carry on, uh, you might consider throwing a few quid towards the Seamus Ennis Arts Centre to support the traditional arts and the independent arts in general. Um, so I suppose it is uh, up to me to sing us out. Uh, this is a song, uh, nice farewell, end of the night song that I learned from uh, Joe Heaney. Not a very popular one, uh, but a lovely one nonetheless. <clears throat> Actually, I might have to just take my volume down a bit. I'm at, I'm at speaking volume right now, but uh, my singing volume is a little higher. One second. <clears throat> It's the last night of my stay Ere I ramble far away All for to seek my fortune on a foreign shore And but before I go away Tonight I will be gay for tomorrow I'll be far away from home, boys from home. Tomorrow I'll be far away from home. And to a strange and distant land with an honest heart and hand. Strange destiny obliges me to roam. But come joy will or woe, no matter where I go. I'll never forget the dear old friends at home, boys from home. I will never forget the dear old friends at home. Well, they say the American land is all wealthy, gay, and grand. With virtues and great riches shining o'er. But if every grain of sand were a diamond in that land I would still love dear old Ireland more and more boys from home I would still love dear old Ireland more and more Here's it to my youthful joys to my country girls and boys and to every Irish heart that I adore on America's sunny shore there is wealth for me galore the time is fast approaching, I must go, boys from home. The time is fast approaching, I must go. Here's to the friends I leave in the sweet land of the free. And may the stars of freedom on them shine. And if God on his high throne will give Ireland back her own, we'll hunt the cruel tyrants from our shore, boys from home. We'll hunt the cruel tyrants from our shore. It's the last night of my stay, ere I ramble far away, all for to seek my fortune on a foreign shore. 
But before I go away, tonight I will be gay. For tomorrow I'll be far away from home, boys, from home. Tomorrow I'll be far away from home. <laughs> Thanks very much, folks. Thank you, Jared. Always brilliant. Thank you. Right. We'll, of course, uh, be back next month. And, Fantastic. Yeah, just follow the Seamus Arts Centre on their all social media platforms to get some information about that. Uh, but yeah, you you have the ability to unmute yourselves and say say your goodbyes, yeah. but we will be pulling the plug momentarily. <laughs> Man, <laughs> good night, all. Thanks very Good night, all. 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 Good night, all.